like y'all got mo- y'all better act like y'all got Tupac in this house. All right, YouTube like to play with the lights. Keep on pressing that button till they let it up. Go ahead, FBI, let it up. Go ahead, FBI, stop holding the lights back because they're hitting the like button. It's you, FBI. We already know y'all holding me back. Press the like button. Press it. Come on. Keep on pressing. I'm just as stubborn as y'all. Nigga, I got a whole lot to say. All right. You gotta keep watching me then. I know I'm entertaining. And I'm getting tired too. Yeah. Don't make me lose my thought. I've been drinking. I've been drinking. How is it our representative? That's the best you can find as a uh as a as a representative of New York. I mean, Ja Rule's more of a representative of New York than Hassan Campbell. It, I mean, listen, man, it depends on how you think. I'm going to drop the link for Saladin. Saladin might want to come up here because Saladin is my voice of reason. Uh, before I drop that link, go ahead and subscribe to King of Receipts, Repeats. It's also pinned at the top of the – um. it's also – the link is pinned. Yeah, that type of work. You know what I'm saying? I don't see what Saladin got to say about this. This was a little while ago. I, I, I mean, like, we just doing God's work. I'm just cloud chasing at this point. Y'all want me to finish dusting this nigga off or what? Why y'all taking so long? First and foremost, y'all better be happy. I'm even addressing this shit because the truth of the matter is, I done lost $300,000 <laughs> since I've been demonetized. Get in the chat. How much money y'all think that he lost? Yeah, my checks was different. My lifestyle was different. Now let's get back to that. I only came here copy, for one copy, reason. Copy, Saladin. Are you not entertained? Hit the mo- uh, all right. I'm being nice by telling y'all to get to a thousand. All right. Let's see who give it first. I don't get paid for this live. I don't give a fuck. You said that? I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Not a single fuck. Not this fuck. I don't give this fuck neither. You, I bet you hit that like button before I start talking anymore. Keep on going. We ain't get to a thousand yet. All right. Jam on that. Jam on that. We almost there. Two more. There we go. Let's go. Let's get to that. Let's get to that. Nigga, I created that. Slow. No, I didn't. I'm lying. That's the alcohol right there. I made it famous. But why the fuck do you niggas come home from jail? They feel like it's something special about you. You spent 18 years in jail. Zip, I got a question for you. But I'm going to answer your question first. My children has never met Af- Africa Bambada. That's oh. for one. I'm going to answer another question. <laughs> when Tribe Core Quest album was released, <laughs> it's not when it was made. When Tribe Core Quest album was released, it's not when it was made. When I sat up there and I said, Africa Band Bottle loved me, so he put me on the album. I was being sarcastic. I was drunk and being disrespectful. But nevertheless, I'm not even I, I, I wonder what the real reason was, though. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to change the way you feel. Whatever way you felt, you felt that way before you got on your knees and sucked my dick. What? Wait, wait. Respectful. But nevertheless, I'm not even trying to change the way you feel. Whatever way you felt, you felt that way before you got on your knees and sucked my dick. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, hell no. Nah. You went out your way to meet oh, me. Nah. You, felt, 
You felt that way before you got on your knees and sucked my dick. See, this is what I'm saying. This is why I don't be feeling sorry for niggas, man. And then y'all got the nerve, like some niggas that be coming for zip, got the nerve to be, yeah, I, this, it remind me of the shit that y'all do with me though, man. That, I ain't gonna lie, man. It's like watching the same shit happen over and over and over again. You know what I'm saying? So you want niggas to jump on their knees and suck your dick. After you say shit like that, I can't feel sorry for what the niggas say back, man. You went out your way to meet me. Them poor children. I didn't go out my way to meet you. You went out your way Fact. to meet me after 18 years of sticking a mother load up your ass. Oh. Now, I'm just trying to figure out. Now, ain't no pause. What you mean? Fuck all the bullshit. We ain't pausing. You can't pause the truth. When Blue, when, when Blue Boy put the knife on your cell, ooh, we about to get deep right now. He put the knife on your cell and told you to lock out, you bitch ass nigga. You back down. Instead, you shit it out. A balloon with size, and you gave Blue Boy. You shit it out the mother load, and you paid that nigga off so he didn't kill you when you came out your cell. Look, stick to that. What? Oh no, that's not even all of it. Why did you become Muslim in jail? Huh? Why did you become Muslim in jail? Mr. Zip with the dripper, drip with the zip. Mr. Zipper, zipper. zipper. See, we getting disrespectful. Let's take a quick break before I bring Jamel Saldane up here, man. I do want y'all to hear this, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, big shout out to King Troll. I bumped into this a little while ago. Uh, uh, yeah. Nasty work, Shalonda. Mean little Bronx bitch. She's a mean. Come fuck with a real nigga. Remember you skin. Remember that, baby. Don't make me send it to Knowledge Corn. Knowledge, look, you see, you got me calling Knowledge Corn. That nigga's got me calling my own man Knowledge Corn. Yo, Knowledge, listen, I'm going to keep it real. When you keep calling him Knowledge Corn, basically you saying you want corn in your mouth. Corn on the car. What the fuck is a corn on the car? Shout out to the king of receipts, man. <laughs> yeah, quick break. You know what I'm saying? Oh, uh, yeah. Let me bring Jamel Saldin. My voice of reasoning, you know what I'm saying, keeps me out of trouble. Let me bring him up here. Mac, what's what type good, of bro? Jack? I mean, like, what, what, what type of background is that, bro? Like, what type mm. of background? Is that? You know what I'm saying? What's, what, mm. what's that? A podcast? What do, you, what do you what you got going on over there? You playing like with the internet and shit? What's I going play on? different. I play different. I ain't gonna. Different. I ain't gonna hold it. I play different. I ain't gonna hold it. Slightly different. We're not talking about aliens, so I don't know right. if you, this is going to. Right, right, right. I could dip, I could bob and weave. You know what I'm saying? Let me see what you got right. going on over here. All right, so let listen. See. Let me ask you something. Did, did, did you get? Um, did you see some of this video? Did you see anything? Nah, I'm I'm watching it as you playing it. The last thing he said was very rocky and crazy, and it was out the blue. But this is, you know, if you watch my video, I said son does this. He gets to drink, you know. I see you. I see he grabbed the drink a second ago, mm -hmm. and, and this is why I was talking to his counselor. I don't know who his counsel counselor is. You know, if it's Wild Bill, I don't know if it's T Matt. I don't know who's on, over there on the squad. You know, shout out to his 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 support system over there. But uh. me me watching from afar, I say yo 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 yo. Whoever his support system is. You know, you could give him a little drink because he he get funny and all that, yeah. But not too much. Not you too gotta much. know. You gotta know when to cut son off because he starts saying rocky stuff like what he just said out the blue though. Oh, let me let me let me rewind it a little bit because I ain't really get I ain't catch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, he's bugging. Yeah, I seen. Wait a minute, what's that in his hand? That that might be the. He's making shanks at at the crib. He, <laughs> <laughs> But he sells them joints on Etsy. He got his own shank brand. He got his shank brand and all that. Remember, we was trying to set, um do the uh, teach niggas how to spit razors class. I don't know. He <laughs> right. he's, he's watching our old work and all that, and and trying to reform. Ain't nothing new under the sun, Mac. Me, you see, he's he's rebranding our old ideas. 
He's done, House, he's, he's making his own shanks and selling them joints on Etsy. You did. House Park says, "Oh, uh, he still hasn't provided paperwork about them three murders that he allegedly did." Uh, that's that's Hollis. Hollis says that. Hit the like button, please. You can still worry about that old work. <laughs> that's not about the shank or not. That's the only thing I really care about. Let me see. He put the knife on yourself. Oh, it's a pair of scissors. Even worse. Even worse. Let me just see. I told you to lock out, you bitch ass nigga. <laughs> you back down. Instead, you shit it out. A balloon. Which size? Why they keep saying this about zip? Like, like you know, I, I've, I've, I've talked about the boofing stories and stuff like that. I've never personally boofed nothing. You know what I'm saying? But I've talked about these boofing stories. Why are we magnifying everything that's sexual? Everything uh, sexual, we just, we, I mean, this is this reading very sexualized. Is this an orange and a lemon? What the fuck? Yo, 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 Mac. I, I told everybody I was hard. I was a horrible drug dealer, right? I was a horrible drug dealer. So I can't really out eyeball ounces and all of that, right? Maybe but fine. but son, is that that's not an ounce? Like I know I know dudes on the street that was boofing, that was boofing ounces to go up north and all that. Shit. About it, huh? Can we just complete? Because Venezuela is doing videos about boofing shit. You know what I'm saying? I don't. Even... Well, he's he's Demis, he's Richard Simmons in this joint. What what what, what kind of yeah, videos he doing? Having graphic depictions of what. I don't know what he's doing. Nah, nah, nah. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just explaining right now. You know, '90s. A lot of people was going up to Binghamton, New is that Ports, a great suit in the orange, what the fuck is New that? Ports, and all that. And and you know, I know people that was going up there and boot. You know, they booth the ounce or whatever, and then get on the uh, Greyhound. But that it don't look like. Like I said, I'm not a great. I was never a great drug dealer. Is that an ounce? Well, that's way more than an ounce. What are we talking about, bro? That's crazy that's talk. That's right a Hassan ounce. Them <laughs> ounces are bigger. That's Hassan ounce. Now, the one on the right side, that's a regular ounce. Oh, the okay. One, the okay. other one, the big one, yeah, that's a Hassan ounce. Yikes. But I don't know how he would know that because he never did no time. He only did a... a he, I think he would, yeah, that was a. You know what? I, I, if we would have gave him a little bit more liquor, he would have went and got a water. Bro, on. this is what I'm saying. Like, it's a lot of cap when it comes to jail stories and prison stories, bro. This is why I be shooting the jail stories that we got to differentiate. I'm not gonna shoot your jail story down. I'm just gonna let it be known. You talk about jail, or you talk about prison? Okay, you talk, about, you talk about jail. Okay, okay. Uh, in jail and prison, I think they both get watermelon. Hmm. Trust me. But let me finish playing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cool boy. You shitted out the mother load and you paid that nigga off so he didn't kill you when you came out to sell. What other fruits do you think he got at his disposal right there, though? <laughs> <laughs> I'm curious, because he just popped these things out. Look. Yo, you know what's ill? When you come to your YouTube with props, like you got wow props already. You got oranges. You got all the fruits. It's crazy, bro. All right. Why is too? <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, yo. They got the fake, fake work going on in the Mac meme, man. Hey, Roski, I told you hit my IG. You dumb. You dumb if you don't, man. He got a new video on you? Man, they got video, they got crazy videos. Hey, yo, listen, Roski. Yeah, I'm, 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 shit. Shout out to Roski, man. No, not Roski. I'm talking about the ops, the opskies, right? Roski. Oh, 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 oh. Trust me, hit, hit me, hit me, bro. I'm gonna give you YouTube gold, my nigga. And you pop out when you're ready. Been trying to hit you, but you don't, you don't know how to follow the lead, man. Don't play with the devil. Scar Squad over here. You know what I'm saying? Looking crazy. Modesty, I see you. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's finish getting back to the work. Yeah, yeah. Oh, let's get to that. Dirty section want me. <laughs> what? The oh, fuck? no. That's not even all of it. Why did you become Muslim in jail? Huh? Why did you become Muslim in jail? Mr. Zip with the dripper. Drip with the zip. Mr. Zipper. 
Zipper, zip, you would let me, let me ask you. Let me ask you something. Why is that important? Huh? Why is that important? I'm sorry that he came where he keep became Muslim at. You know what I'm saying in jail. I, I wanted to um, I wanted to hear what he 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 had to say. Right. Um, yeah. With the zipper, zip zipper. Who got the key? To zip zip zipper. You like the zipper. The zipper leads to the asshole. The asshole leads what? to the mother load. And the mother That's what I'm saying. Why is the asshole the grapefruit? And what? This nigga got so much fruits. Zipper. Zip, you were fascinated with the zipper. Zip, zipper. Who got the key to zip, zip, zipper? Got cantaloupe. You like the zipper. The zipper leads to the asshole. The oh, asshole. gosh. This is what I don't understand, bro. Now... Stop it for a second. Stop it for a second. Stop there were some playing second. niggas with drugs that you hid in your ass. So after 18 years of you hiding drugs in your ass, <sighs> for 18 years, you had balloons. Yo, thank you. Pause it. Pause it. Pause it. Yeah, thank you for your concern, concern, Roski. Thank you for your concern. But no, thank you. Yo, yo, Mac, this is, this is my point right now. I heard you say it and I heard Zip say it. You said he took down the video. He deleted the video. Zip said he asked him, he told him, yo, I don't, I don't want to make no more videos on you, right? Now, is this because Saladin started to make sense? Is this because I'm showing you why you are not valuable to the corporate life? You can't get up here on YouTube and start talking about a man's butt cheeks like the way you do and expect corporate dollars to flow in bro it don't work like that bro is it you not you have not officially registered with the lgbt community for you to be doing that if you had officially registered with them then that would be a different story you don't go to none of their powwows you don't do none of that you ain't paid your fare you ain't paying the kitty over there at the LGBT, none of that, bro. You ain't checking with the big homies over there at the LGBTQ community, none of that. So you're not riding their wave. So therefore, it sounds crazy everything you're saying that comes out your mouth when it comes to this. So I think he's starting to listen, maybe, if that's the case. I don't know. I heard recently he don't want to do no more videos on set. The thing is, bro, you got to stop this, this, this homosexual talk and you now and you claim not to be homosexual is bananas. It's bananas. It goes too far. What say you, Mac? Um, I'm in the greens. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I just didn't want to take over the show, you know what I'm saying? Because I'll start taking no, over. No, 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 no. I, I, I told you I need the voice of reason because I ain't here to troll him. I'm just trying to show, you know, break it down and analyze it. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. Of weed that you were sticking in your ass <laughs> in jail. I didn't know you said all this. And now you want to come crazy. home. And you don't want to fuck the grown woman. You think the grown woman is supposed to let you fuck their daughters. You got grown women out there sending their kids to college. Nah, they too old. You with the teeny bombers. Nigga, I That's you. not what he said. You are, hey, you let are me ask you something, Saldane. Don't mm -hmm. do you not understand that the fact that that a nigga coming home from jail, you know what I mean? Um, he's not talking about he wants underage females. He's saying that he like them younger. Is there anything wrong with that? Nah, I heard what he said. He said twenty three and up. He's knocking them down, and I'm I'm not gonna be a hypocrite and say I'm not knocking nothing down as twenty three. You understand? If I wasn't with my wife, you're bugging, bro. You understand what I'm saying? Like you're 23, you're what you bugging, about, bro. What do you think about that pitch of Cora? Um, what do I think about it? How does she look nice in the picture, or uh, the or the fact that he said um he's too she's too old? I wonder. I don't, I wonder what the angle is with that over there. You know what I'm I mean, um, he well, Hassan already said that's his little sister, or whatever, like that. So. He's saying, only saying something about her, her being old because she's sitting next to him. I mean, like, you know, like she's obviously an attractive woman. You know what I'm no, saying? No, no, he so, didn't. Zip didn't say she wasn't an attractive woman. He said she's too old, meaning yeah. I don't even want a chick that's 30 or something like that. I want a, I want a young 
to um twenty something year old chick. There and that you know that energy is all different too. You know that, right? right? All that energy is different. So a, a thirty year old some and a twenty three year old some is just different energy. And maybe he's on that type of timing. So that's totally different from her being underage. She could be 23, don't live, she could live by herself. We don't know her situation, bro, at 23. All we know is she's 23. No, nobody says she was 23 living with her moms. She could be out here pushing an X7 23. She's a bee. You're a predator. Right. Anyway, you fit in that. You keep pushing the button. And you don't even realize how strong I am. Then you acting like you the illest nigga in Nebraska. Hey, yo, son. You ain't surpassed 10 toes down yet. He a little nigga. You ain't support, you ain't surpassed 05 older movement yet. And ain't little niggas. <laughs> nigga, you ain't even surpassed doggy dummies yet. You ain't get to that hundred thousand dollar bridge. So you could hang your nuts? You ain't gully TV. Oh, boy. He Even ain't, though I know you're cool with like gully, mother. but you're not gully. You a little nigga that I made. I made you. I'll break you, too. Nah, nah. Not this is good talk. Pause it right there. Pause it. Pause it. Pause it. So many more just like you, because the niggas that I named before you. See, that was good rhetoric, Hassan. That was good rhetoric right there. This, this is what I'm talking about. We're going to spar. We're going to spar. Spar. Go there, but I don't see why you just be going left. Like it be going good, like right now, right? He's talking about yo, I made you. This, that, that's good rhetoric right there. As soon as you start talking about like out of nowhere, you just mention a man's butthole. What are we talking about, bro? Why why you do that? Broadcast in the building. Yeah, yeah. You going left. He going left. He going left. Yeah, why'd you do that? He made him. I mean, well, I don't know, man. He say he made 0502. I made them too. Oh, Ooh. shit. Oh, I should have I been a rapper. I ain't showing your name, my lady. I made all them niggas. You sat up there and heard me play Five Guard drill music. Hey, hold up for a second. Hold up. Let me address something. Roski and VR, the show. Please stop trolling me, man. I don't give a fuck about what them niggas. As a matter of fact, look, you know what? Don't make me do it, man. I'm trying to be patient. Y'all want to troll? Troll what we talking about, bro. If they troll me again, just shoot them. Just shoot them. Shoot them down. Time them out. Don't block them. Just time them out. You know what I'm saying? Because we trying to do a show here. You got Jamel Saldin up here. They would just love to troll. You know what I'm saying? Now they got some thing out, some fake paperwork on me. I'm telling them like, like, okay, if they got the fake, they got the paperwork. Let them, let them run the paperwork, please. Get out the way, or go do a video saying that that you know the shit they saying. They want me to be a rapo. They want me to be all this other goofy shit. So go make a video. If you want to troll here, troll, troll about the shit we talking about, Roski. I told you, chill. I was gonna give you something, but. Now, do God's work, y'all, please. That's the last I got to say about it. Relax. Show mail. Show ID. Show show nothing, man. Relax. All right? I'm done with that. If 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 there's anything that they talk about in the chat, not only Roski and, and, and um, Venezuela. Now, Roski and Venezuela, you time them out. Everybody else, block them. Especially if we, if we don't know them, block them. As soon as they say something that that don't ain't pertaining to this shit right here, you know what I'm saying? I seen what the fuck they talking about, bro. Come on, man, I got time you out, bro. I seen what they talking about. I'm trying to tell you that it's not me, bro. It's not even my name. Relax. It's so simple, but I'm not gonna keep on talking, bro. Damn. A song that sounds just like him. You don't even know how to be you. You heard me play drill music that Five God made, and then you copied his whole style. 
I make five. You know what it I is? You know what it is? Uh, uh Saudi, they want to keep me in the dirty set. They want, without me talking about them, they can't do no content. Because the only thing they do is play back everything I say. So listen, without me talking about them, y'all gotta get that shit on my other channel. My other channel is the link is pinned at the top. It's King of Receipts Repeats. Y'all want rhetoric? Go over there. This upper, this upper level rhetoric over here. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why y'all get so fucking like, 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 uh, like, uh, what, 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 what would you call that? Like, you know what I mean? Like, like when, when, when daddy leave or mommy leave and you, what they call that? Attachment. Like so much attachment to, you know what I'm saying? Relax, man. There's other people out here, man. Hey. I made Lord I Kim a household name. I made 10 toes down a household name. I wow. made old, old movement a household name. Do I got it? You agree with that? Nah, the thing that really pushed Ten Toes down, like in a way, in that very indirectly, he did. So what happened was because Ten Toes had already started shooting at him, um, Kwame Brown actually helped out Ten Toes down platform way more than Hassan. He was just. He was in the right place at the right time, ten toes down. So because he had a connection with Hassan and he had and they had a common enemy, that's you know, and at that time, Kwame Brown, if he's mentioning your channel, if he bring you up, if he's shouting you out, that's gonna make you go. And that really helped him out more than anything, way more than Hassan did. Way more than Hassan did. I think um I think. If anybody you got the about, most, you if anybody got the most juice right, right. out of talking about Hassan, it was ten toes down. I mean, he overjuiced that thing. You know what I'm saying? Like he, now I don't know who overjuiced it more because O five O was going nuts at one point. Actually, they was both going crazy. Um, but it was like at one point it was a lot of Hassan videos. So, but did he do the wrong thing by doing that? Nah, it. He took advantage of the system. You know, you do it from time to time. You'll just talk about one person. Just stay on his heels until your numbers come up. I don't know about helping them, though. That's a different... That That's different from helping them and making them. You understand what I'm saying, Mac? Like, that's different. When you help somebody, you do that consciously. He didn't say, yo, let me bring you up on my platform. Let's... You know what I'm saying? It was none of that. Now you did speak about it the other day, and, and um, I thought it was was an ingenious way of trying to figure out what was going on. What uh, the whole, you know, like the meeting and shit. I'm gonna play a little bit of what you said. That's a um, fact, whack second. dog. You know I I heard him say that, but I ain't know. <laughs> Jamel Shabazz is my man. That's a fact. Um, wax diggity, wax dog. Yeah. I, I ain't want to play with Lord I, Lord I Kim though. I was about to say, who's Lord? What? What are you talking about? But then that would have been that would have looked nasty because I don't know Lord I Kim and he would have took offense. So I just kept my mouth closed. You know what I'm saying? Like, his like button, y'all. You know what I'm saying? All right, let me play some more. Keep going on. I made you a household name, nigga. I made all oh, the niggas that I made, they bigger than you already. So you said if I made you make another new, you, nigga, you wouldn't get to that level yet. Hold up. He look, we look. Bring it back up. You ain't get to that level yet. What are you talking about? You still ain't even get to that level yet. Five God is a household name. Me and Five God had a fallout. Based off of opinions and me putting opinions on the internet on how I felt about what happened to K Flock. And no matter what you niggas say about oh Hassan Campbell, I don't know K Flock, but I love K Flock. And it hurt me to see K Flock and Deep Dan go to jail. And me and Five Guard fell, fell out over that. Because I felt like, or rather, he may have felt like. It's not like where y'all fell out, bro. Whatever the case may be. That's not where y'all fell out. Over K Flock going to jail. And me feeling like 
he had more of an influence over him and he should have did better. And we had arguments over that. What the fuck you think I'm going to have a fallout with you over? You think I'm going to be quiet while you talking about you want to fuck the little girls? You think that you can sit up in jail for 18 years, come home 42 years old, 40 years old, and it's okay for you to fuck our teenagers? No, you piece of shit. All right, stop right there. Teenager <laughs> and a 20... 20 that's, see, that's totally different, bro. Yeah, that's that's worse semantics. That's that that's worse semantics, bro. So when you say young girls and all of this, come on, bro. We know who we talk about when we say young girls, bro. All right, we talking about girls that's old enough to legally drink, go to the army, fight for their country. He zip said a twenty three year old. Hold up a second. What's up? Yo, what's up, my nigga? <laughs> <laughs> nah, no trolling, no trolling, sir. You heard no trolling, sir. Yo, why you not making beats or some shit, my nigga? You got what you saying, bro? Hmm. Uh, I don't know, Stacks. I know, I know Jamel Shabazz because you know he he Jamel Shabazz. He. he I, I might. I I don't know that brother by that name. I don't know. I don't know Kassan Dajula by that name. But it's possible I I see the face and be like, oh, you talk about son? Oh yeah, you know what I'm saying. But shout it out though. Um. Anyway. Um. You know. I see what Roski's saying, right? Roski's saying, yo, you, if you 40-something... See, Roski got limits on the lowest he gonna go on the chick. He's like, yo, if I'm 40-something, I'm only dealing with chicks in their 30s. But that is his perception. That's how you looking at it. But I don't think there's anything morally wrong with Hold that. Up. Let me go back a second. Give me one second. So I'll be... I'll just... Unless it's somebody... You don't like that's that's kind of true, Majestic Allah. I think we're biased because automatically we we have in the head that okay they we've seen that they're deception right as if we we couldn't be just as deceptive, but we seen their deception. They have a history, so that's in our brain. So it's like nah, they conjuring something up. So I did think that at first. I'm like nah, they conjuring something up as. I started to read and they said they had witnesses and other details was coming out. And I think even Brown Barrett even said she mentioned the STDs. It wasn't in that there. I'm going to let him drop the link for you, Roski. Information. But I, I have, you know, researched this a little bit outside of this context. And it's nasty work, man. So like she said, Children with STDs, yo, bro, at the end of the day, even, even if you didn't do it, you this is your compound. This is your compound, which means you did not know what was going on in your own compound. That's what you're going to say? But no, definitely. To be yeah, honest with you, it's too I got much you. evidence stacked against you. So my answer is this, and then we can get off of that. Do I think the United nah, States? We're not. This is this is not the channel to you know. Y'all got to go to my my troll channel for that. You know what I'm saying? That's the, oh, oh, no, I, don't, I, I don't. I don't know. He, he, Roski wasn't talking about that, but I understand what you're saying. Roski wanted oh. to talk to me about the underage girl business. That's what Roski wanted. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, Roski, yeah. Roski, the link is the link is pinned. Roski, if you want to talk about that, you know what I'm saying. But at all other business will be on my troll channel, bro. We cloud chasing over here. And we executing with a very sharp sword. So y'all don't, don't I mean, don't I mean don't be ginger on that shooting button. Clap anything. I don't give a fuck who it is. Time them out, block them, do whatever you want to do with them. I, I because I keep telling people this is not the channel for that. So I'm gonna start blocking niggas from the thing. Pain, you ain't got nothing to say. Bye. Yeah, that okay, Brooklyn Carter. You get what I'm saying? And that was that's what was in my head, Brooklyn Carter. I didn't I didn't say it, but that's what I was thinking, Brooklyn Carter. A 23 old 
bro, a 23 year old. That's what exactly what I was thinking. A 23 year old stripper. Yo, bro, who's, what's who's, up? Who's, who's bro, I was trying to talk about the stripper nigga, dog. You know what I'm saying? With the click clicks and Comstock and shit, B. Damn, son. Stop kicking me out. I ain't patrolling, B. A 23-year-old stripper who's out here doing her thing in Jersey got the got the house on Edgewater. You know what I'm saying? She got an X7. Everything on her is foreign. She, she ain't asking nobody for nothing. What you said about STDs? What you said? I didn't say nothing about none of that. I'm talking about something else. Oh my bad. That oh. is totally different from. We know, we know, we but you know, but but Sade, let's be fair. He's just it, it's just something to talk about. Come right, on, man. It's right, just something right. To talk about. It's something right. to talk about. And that's what we it. are. We are we we YouTube content creators, so that's what we give them something to talk about, and we talking about it. But look, but whether it's valid or not, now that's what we talking about, and we know that that's not valid. Nothing that he's talking about. But hold, on, let me just play his last piece that I wanted to get. You know what I'm saying? Did this to save the children? Do I think the United States locked up Dr. Malachi York because they wanted to save children from getting abused? Hell no. The United States has its own history of perversions, butt breaking our men, and doing all type of stuff. They were still butt breaking prisoners in. Um, it's pinned at the top, Ross. Um, Guantanamo Bay, they was doing nasty work out there. It's a fact, Brooklyn Carter. United States is... Brooklyn. I don't think they did this to save the children. But can can we deny? All right, there go the link right there. Let me let this shit catch up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, uh, I'm going to play a little bit more of this right here. You know what I'm saying? Let's get to the work. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Now, now, Roski, you got to listen. If you, you got to understand something, man. Just because you don't like somebody, you can't make them, you can't make them say something that they didn't say. You feel me? You know what I mean? Like, you can't make shit up. You got to dig? Talking about, yeah, Hask, you was a no victim. You was a participant. Nigga, you sound like a pedophile. Any man that is set up there, see, here's the thing, right? Let me let me take you out of school, right? Let me take you out of school real quick. You think there's a chance for Hassan to still do like 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 victim victim work? You know what I'm saying? Like like I'm talking about like speak for victims and shit like that. Can he can like with a good publicist? Can you fix it? Let's say if you had a hundred bands, right? Can you fix up his image and prep him for you know what I'm saying? Some shit like that. I can, but I gotta be around them all the time. You understand? Know I gotta be around them more. You understand? Because he needs a babysitter for the first couple, like couple of months. So I could definitely fix it up, but that's gonna. I gotta tell my wife. Listen, I gotta go on the road. I gotta go on the road because I can't. I can't trust nobody else to babysit him because they're not gonna tell. They're not gonna knock the drink out of his hand. They're not gonna tell him, "Yo, bro, bro we got to show in the morning. You should really go to the hotel and just relax." You know what I'm saying? They're not gonna tell him that. They're just gonna let him wild out. Next thing you know, I'm in my hotel room. I'm trying mm-hmm. to surf the internet. Who's Who's in the lobby flaming zip talking about buttholes? Oh, man. What is he doing down there? We on a whole campaign right now. He he's, he got all the fruits in the hotel lobby. Pineapples. This man got, this man got cantaloupe whole. <laughs> whole cantaloupe. I'm like, yo, son, where'd you even get that? I, I got to throw on my robe real quick, run down. Yo, son, what you doing? We got a whole show in the morning. He can't help himself. Who Latin pain? Because back Latin pain is back. No, 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 not Latin. Pain. I I didn't say nothing about that. No, nah, don't bring don't bring Latin pain up. He trolling. He weird. Yeah, yeah. But but I I came up here to ask a serious question, right? In the, in the grown people conversation, right? Um, I want to ask this, right? Like 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 seriously, right? Why <laughs> why do females become strippers? Answer that. To get the money. No, no, that's not true, brother. Have you ever spoken you know to why, Max no, that? No, that's not that's not true. But I, I said, why do females turn into strip? Forget the money. Why do females start stripping? I just answered you to get the money. I mean, I'm, I'm, okay. I'm gonna tell. Now, now I'm gonna tell. Now I'm gonna give you the truth. 
Mm-hmm. It ain't it ain't the money. It's because they got either when they was young, they either got molested or turned out. You understand? Oh boy, you are you are living. That, that, that's, that's why. That's why. They, that's why they. That's why they do what they do. Have you ever spoke that's to a stripper and asked her? That's a, that's a fact. That a lot of females that got turned out, they they the majority of them is in them strip clubs. A lot of females that's in them strip clubs, they got turned out, they got molested, raped. A lot of them in them strip clubs. Let's look that now, up. Just be, Let's look that now, up. Now, now, just, Let's look now, now, just because that happened, right? Just because that happened to them when they was young, and then they turned, you know, they, they got older and became a stripper and all that. Does it make it right for a forty-year-old to mess around with them? Does it make it right? So, uh, I, I'm gonna answer your question, Roski, but I, I'm gonna say I disagree. I think now, if you just said, "Why do you young girls get into prostitution?" If you just said, "Why did a twenty-three-year-old get into prostitution?" Then I might have been more inclined to. No, it's both. It. It's both, brother. Prostitution, but you didn't. You, but, same, bro. but you didn't say both, prostitution. Money, you said right? stripping. Let me, ask you money, Let me ask you something. Let Let's say I say that that was true, right? Let's say that I say that was true, right? What does it have to do with this? No, nah, that's why I came up here. I, I came up here because you know zip zip dude. He thinking that people started thinking that's normal when it's not. You know, forty years. So old, you trying to say that a man lusting is after a stripper is is un is something unnatural about that? We are not talking about the stripper, man. We talking about the age. We talking about the dude going online talking about he dealing with twenty year olds and twenty three year olds because we all know Jamal Saladin. If you had a twenty year old daughter, would you accept her coming into your crib with a forty year old? What's your age? You what's your age that? limit? What's your age limit that you if start dating? You, if, if you forty three, if you are forty three, your, your age man, right now. If your age right now, right thirty year old woman and up, man. If you forty, well, look, you're look, 40 you're you're with thirty and up. Let's say I agree with you. Let's say I agree with you, right? Let me ask you this question. Um, um, what's your age limit for you? A my age limit. My age limit. I deal with chicks older than me. Let okay, but what's the youngest? What's the youngest, Bossy? Um, the youngest, the youngest got to be my age, to be honest. <laughs> How old are you, Rossi? Like, yeah. How old are you, bro? I just turned. I'm thirty. Yeah. And you only dealing with thirty and up, and you thirty? Yeah. And you thirty. Yeah. No yeah. wonder you be barbering old people. <laughs> Yo, you're wilding, Rosky. <laughs> Yo, Rosky, you're wilding, my nigga. If I was 30 again, I'm all over the 23 year old. Yo, yo, right. because, because, because let me tell you something. Most older women, I mean, most women want an older man. Most women don't go down to mess with young dudes. That's not true, man. That's no, that true. is absolutely That's true. true. Most That's women not do not go. Okay, women. Any ladies in the chat? Do y'all like older men or younger men? Say older or younger. O or Y. But but why? But why you think? Ask them why. Ask, ask them why. Matter of fact, let's let's, 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 just see, let's just see. Where, let's where just see. Let's just see. Let's see if you know your. Let's just, where, where did it okay, start from? Where okay, but look. Let's just, let's 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 be fair. Huh? Let's let's be fair. Let's leave it up to the women to answer that question. Yeah, yeah. Of course they're gonna. Of course they're gonna say older. Oh, you know the older one. Right. Why? Why? Why is of? Why is of? Of course. If, if this, if I would about. ask the same question, and this wasn't my panel. The women is gonna give you the same answer. I know I'm women. That's what I'm telling, telling you. That. And a woman. Hold up. A woman that looks for a younger dude is looking for a younger dude for a specific reason. Those little relationships don't, normally don't last. They looking for a mature younger dude, not just no younger. dude. Ella never got her groove, bro. Nah, listen, but if an older Mikey chick BSC. looking for a younger dude, if an older chick looking for a younger dude, they're going to make sure he mature for his age, like me. I'm mature right. for my age, so that's yeah, why let's, I got let's, take it, let's take it from the beginning. Let's take it to the beginning. Let's take it to and the that, beginning. And that's different. You can't, you can't compare a young dude to a young female. You can't do that. You can't compare that. Let's, let's take it to different. the beginning. Hold on, Rocky. Let's take it to the beginning, right? You said, you made the point of saying that a lot of women have been raped or molested that strip. Yeah. I one hundred percent agree. They got with turned you. out. They got turned out. That's why I like older men. Younger look, 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 they look. Got turned I, out, look, and that's why look. I like older men. Look what I'm that's, saying, that's right? Like, that's like a dude. That's like a dude look. get molested. Hold up, hold up. Now he's gay. Look, so Saladin. Look, 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 Saladin. I want you to hear me. Saladin disagreed with you, and I'm agreeing with you. 
So I'm the of next. Course, question, of course, gonna, of course, Saladin. Saladin always disagree with me, man. That, that just said, man. You always gonna disagree with me. Nah, that hey, yo, Rasky, yeah. I don't always just disagree. disagree with you to disagree with you because because you know because he Saladin know for a fact if he he wouldn't let no forty year old dude come in the house with his daughter, he know for a fact he wouldn't accept that. No, you know, I so, agree with on. that because yeah. I'm gonna talk to my yeah, Rasky. You right about that, right? Exactly. So, I'm gonna be like, so, so but but listen, Rasky, listen, listen, child, listen, 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 look, Rasky. Like, come on let me let me bring some order. I, I need to talk. I need to talk. I need to talk. Listen. Yeah, why, why you, yo, who this guy got the juice, man? This dude's a clown, if, man. If a 23 year old, if my daughter lives with me at 23 and somebody's 40, that's different, right? If my daughter, did you hear what I said? I said the 23 year old, like, everybody's not the same, but we, we only see out the peripherals of, of our own lenses, right? But once you get out there, you know where Edgewater is at? Um... Rossi, yeah. you ever been to Edgewater? Right that's in Jersey, right? That's Jersey, right? Right. You ever hang out over there? It's no, it's different over there. I know that's Who, that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's different. When you go to Sojo, you ever been to Sojo? Nah, nah, I ain't never been there. Nah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You gotta you gotta come across the bridge sometime and just and just hang out right there on the strip, River Road, yeah. right? You know what I'm saying? And you got all type of chicks with money. Not every 23 year old is broke. She don't need this dude for nothing. She got all right. She all, got, right all right. So listen, so no, listen, man. Right, right. No, 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 we got no, we really got. Nah, we got it's not ignorant. Now, hold on, hold up, hold up. We, 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 when you about, said, man. no, listen, I didn't even when, finish. When you said that, when you said that you like them 30 and up, nobody yeah. said that was weird. Nobody that came at all right, you. All right. I, I told you why it's not weird because a male, a male is totally different from a female. You can't compare a female to a male. It's totally different. Now, now what I'm saying is, if I was 17 years old, I was mature. Let, let's just say, let's go female. She's 17. Now we going years teens. Old. You said teen. No, hold on, hold on. Exit me out. Exit me out. Let's say a female 17 years old. She got her shit together and she got a car. She got a crib and everything, right? Now, does it make just because she got all that at seventeen? Does it does that mean she's mature? To do Bro, I didn't say nothing old? about no it teenagers. Does it make mature for a forty three? Does it make it right for a forty three year old to deal with that seventeen year old? I don't talk That's about teenagers saying. at yeah, all, going, bro. Going by all. I'm not talking about no teenagers, bro. Right? I, I, I feel sorry. I feel sorry, man. Come on, man. Listen, Come on, man. Listen, I, got daughters, I got daughters. I ain't talking about no teenagers, Roski. Who's talking about teenagers? I got daughters and sisters. I ain't jacking that. I ain't jacking no twenty three year old. Girl dealing with a forty-something year old, because a nigga could be forty years old and have a daughter the age. Yeah, but you can't her. tell it, Rossi. My point is this, Rossi. You can't tell no twenty-three-year-old girl with it. And, that, and if you would have let me finish, that's what I was going to say. Because, because my, cause, cause your if my daughter don't like, live with me, bro, if my daughter don't live with me and she's twenty-three and she's out here doing Saladin, nothing, I can't me. stop her, bro. Saladin, I can't Saladin, stop her, bro. Of course you can, but Saladin, you the type that you the type if the law change right now. And they say seventeen years old is legal. You would be okay with that? Nah, nah, I'm not okay. I, I, no, no one's okay with you. You, you mentioned teenagers, bro. You mentioning teenagers. Nobody mentioned teenagers. No, no, no. But but that's nasty let's say, work let's right say there. The law say right now, twenty three years old is teenager. You a bro, lot of dudes would be like, nah, nah, it can't be a teen. No, that can't be. Come on, man. Like Rasky, you, you talking to a you talking to a a man that's married to his to to his forty something year old wife, bro? Why would I need to go and like that's not on my topic? But what I'm saying is, if you, if you're gonna try to turn around the conversation to be like, oh, he shouldn't deal he shouldn't deal with twenty three year olds. I'm saying it's non cipher because he could find a twenty three year old that's that matches his vibration and is not illegal. It's only under your standards, and and he got to ask, who is you? Right. You ain't nobody nah, for nah, me to be that listening that to. Sense, bro. That don't make sense, because you could be 43 years old, and you could find somebody your age that's right. Let me, let me, tell, you, let me tell you something, right? Me, me, being, me dealing with older chicks, right? And that's not say because I'm a man. I'm totally different from a female. It's totally different. You can't compare the two. Now, I'm saying this, right? Now, not, not, not hear this, right? Just, just because, listen, I've seen so many older chicks, right? They got they look young, bro. Let's just get that out. So don't tell me no older guy should be looking at a young chick when you got 40, 50 year old woman that look like they 23. So don't so so any nigga, that's why I say any dude that, that that's 40 something years old and you looking at a motherfucking 20, the, 20 this nigga's the cougar old, slayer. 20, He's the cougar slayer. You joking, I'm dead serious. <laughs> You know, you, you're looking at niggas on the prowl for right? cougars only. That, that, that cougars means, that means, only. Listen, listen, that means you gotta keep. That means you listen. If you a forty some year old looking at a twenty some year old sexually. That means nigga, I gotta keep my damn nieces away from you. And shit. I gotta keep my nieces, my little <laughs> sisters away from you and all that. 
No, you 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 can't you can't even have your if your brother if your brother's dealing with if your brother's dealing with a twenty five year old or a twenty year old right and he's fifty years old. That means you gotta keep your daughter away from. That means you gotta. All right, keep let's. Away from all right, all right. So let me break this down for you. Let me break this down for you. Um, let, me, let me break this down for you. Um, a lot, a lot of people graduate high school at eighteen, right? They go away for four years to college. Let's just take the uh, average person, right? Even the median, fifty percent of the population, right? They, they they would go away to college during those years in college. They that yo, person. Yo, that yo, they, hold on, hold on, I, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, I just let I you go some, on I'm and not, on. I'm not cutting you off. I, I'm not cutting you off. I gotta say something. Anybody in the chat that's disagreeing with what I'm saying, because I'm speaking facts. You see, I ignorant. I can suck my dick, but go ahead and talk to more. <laughs> Yo, only I, you and Bullets, I let y'all call me Jamal, bro. Only you and Bullets, I let y'all call me Jamal. Bro, bro you can't be telling people suck your dick on the panel, bro. Come on, man. Just, just have a conversation. Don't worry about the chat, man. Um, so she goes away. The ninth grade, grade year, she's damn near still, you know what I'm saying, a, basically a kid because she's this is her first year going into anything. But from her, her, her freshman year, not her ninth grade year, her freshman year. Her freshman year in college to the senior year is totally different, right? The, the everything is different. The mind state, all of this, right? She just took all these classes. She done dealt with a bunch of dudes. She's different, right? Now she goes into her internship. So check it. That's 22. That's 22 when she graduated. She does her internship at a law firm, right? And now she's playing with the big boys, right? They start her off at 90000 She got her own apartment, this, that, and the third. Um, she pays her own bills. She makes her own decisions. She's out here doing grown people stuff. Um, Roski, I don't, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm going to stand on mine and say I don't think there's nothing wrong. If she's into Zip and Zip is into her, that's their business, bro. That don't got nothing to do with being perverted. She's too young. Yeah, yeah, uh, not, yeah, yeah. None of that, bro. What are you yo, talking how, about? Highlight, highlight you content. Uh, yo, put, put, you, put you sports talk to you. Yeah, I mean, uh, Carmen. He, he, he said he said, said my wife is 30 and I'm 40. That's, that's yeah. I agree. I agree. That's the only comment I agree with in the chat. The other motherfuckers, man, I suspect. Bro, your phone man. messing that's up. Two, two, hey, two, hold on right. a second. Your shit is tweaking, bro. You in the blender. You in the blender, son. Go ahead, my bad. Now, you you know what I don't like? This is what I... I'm, I'm going to tell you what I don't like, Ross. I'm going to keep it a thousand with you. And this may be hypocritical, but I, this is how I feel. Say that same 40-some-year-old dude, right? He's He don't got nothing going on for himself. He just really praying on some chick. You know what I'm saying? He's he just praying, trying to use her. He's not trying to elevate her. He don't got nothing to elevate her. You understand what I'm saying? He, he, he she, she's just, he's just trying to weigh her down. He's trying to come up off of her, beat her down more. Then I don't like those. I, I hate to see those situations because it's like, damn, baby, why, why are you even with this older dude if he can't help you? You, you, you understand what I'm saying? It's that don't make sense to me. That don't make listen. Sense. What, what, what I'm saying is, Jamal, what I'm saying is something I'm saying is, why go for a why be 40 some years old going for a younger chick when you could go for a chick your age? That's what I'm saying, man. This is a big ass world. We got we, there's 10 men for every there's 10 women for every man. So for to choose to go for the young one, that's come on, man. Come because, on. You see, okay, I, 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 that's how I was raised, man. I, I wasn't raised to go for no young chick or be 50 years old and go for no young chick. You understand? I'm just going to say this, right? You got a 50 year old woman, and this is my experience. You got a 50 year old woman, they vagina more tighter than a 25 year old. That's all I got to say. This nigga's the Kruger Slayer. You the Kruger Slayer. I got to know this when we going out. I see this nigga Roski like, yo, I'm looking for my wingman. Roski be over there surrounded by the Kruger's spitting game over there. I got to come yoke Roski up. Nigga, we got some bad joints over here. He like Saladin. You don't see all these old, <laughs> all these old joints on your boy. Oh, Roski. Oh, Roski. What you doing? You're messing the night up, nigga. Listen, Roski. Um. Again, that that's just how I feel. Um, if she's she's old enough 
to really make these type of decisions. And you keep saying choosing, right? So suppose just a love story, real quick. Um, yo, 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 solid Dean, you keep hold up. I mean, yourself. Give me, you give saying, me, give me five minutes, five minutes, five minutes, five. Every time I go to talk, just no, give me two minutes, two minutes, two minutes. Down, two minutes. Give me two minutes without interruption. Two minutes, two minutes. two minutes without interruption. All right, twelve o'clock, New York City. I, I, I'm, the, I'm working at the Carpenters Union. I go to the deli. I see a chick walk in with the whole pantsuit or whatever like that. She, Yo, she's bad. I don't ask how old she is. You know what I'm saying? I at least see a little name tag on her or whatever like that. Um, Little uh, American flag lapel or whatever like that on her joint. And I get the kicking game. This, Yo, what's going on, baby? She's feeling me. I ain't ask her age. I asked her name. She ain't asked my age. She asked my name. We exchange numbers, this, that, and the third. But later on, I ask her, yo, we going out, this, that, and the third. Then I ask, yo, so how old are you anyway? She tells me, oh, I'm 23. I say, oh, snap. She said, why? How old are you? I say, yo, I'm 45. She was like, okay. She don't pay no mind. She's with it. I don't pay no mind because I'm already digging on her. She's already digging on me. You think I'm supposed to stop right there and be like, oh, you only 23? I'm sorry, baby. I'm out of here. That None of that shit is real. And, and, and that's why there's a bunch of perverts out here because they be like, I don't think that's perverted, 17? bro. No, listen, listen, man. I'm not. Who you keep on talking about listen, 17? Listen, listen, Niggas listen, ain't listen. talking about 17, listen, my listen, nigga. You keep, saying, you keep saying she could be 20-something immature, right? Just like yes, a, just like a forty-five year old nigga could be mature and all that got his shit together. So if he got okay. his shit together, he mature. Then why go for something young? Then that's what right, I'm the, saying. The, the, it be, the, it be the, a whole contradiction. Of, like I be caught. That's not so contradiction. Up, that's not contradiction. Like, if you teenagers into that, why go for something? Hold on. The moral, of, the moral story is that you don't agree with the selection or, or, or the age bracket of the women that he like. All right, so I'm gonna move on. Because I, I mean, outside of you not liking it, I don't know what else we can do about that. Because silence is approval. And some of y'all don't know what happened between me and Africa Bambata. Because they claim that that's my claim to fame, but a lot of my followers don't even know who the fuck Africa Bambata is. Is that Cap Roski? He said a lot of his followers don't even know who Bam is. Zulu Nation makes Africa Bear about to step down. And D-Trail is on your heels. The Cougars is on you right now, Rossi. They want that. Oh, yeah. I want you to understand something. Because I'm responding to the lies that this nigga's telling. He was, he, he's trying to be a master manipulator because he wants me to give him his, my energy. And I'm giving him that because I still want to see Zip win. No, you don't. I was about to salute him for that. You don't think so? Nah, he do. Listen, listen, boy, boy in the comment. Listen, man, you got you got younger chicks that got more kids than older chicks. So stop it, bro. Stop. It. I know older. I do. I know older chicks that only get one, got one kid. You understand? So stop it, man. Don't say oh because they got they they they. Nah, it's these nowadays. Majority of younger chicks they got babies, man. Majority of them got like five to three kids. And they and they boxes washed up respectfully. They got they they, they boxes all loose. I know I deal with older chicks. I deal with old chicks. They, they, they Forty-five years old and they boxes very, very, very tight. You understand? Very tight and in good shape. Roski, D Trail got a place for you to stay tonight, nigga. She's on your heels, nigga. She got a place for you to stay tonight, nigga. You understand? I'm, I'm just gonna go back woman. She's no D Trail is, is a woman, my nigga. <laughs> she's on your she's on your heels, man. That took place that I'm about to play. I know everybody in this meeting. It broke everybody hard to be at this meeting. They hated me. Some of them, not all of them, hated me for this meeting. Because they did not want to destroy Africa Bambada. Africa Bambada had a meeting with me and some of them. And he told every last one of them that everything that I said was true, that he really did he did molest me. This oh, is why he made him God. step down. This oh. is some of the most powerful people in New York City from the from the um, UBN. 
He just started in Go- the UBN, the United I, I, Blood I, I, Nation. That was famous. Which I UBN we talk about? No, the United Black Nation. I don't know. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> from, okay. In New York City, from the from the um UBN. Yeah. Nah, I gotta and hear everybody this. Everybody in this video was famous. Oh, wow. Everybody in this video was famous. The show the video. So Zip, when you start trying to manipulate and tell lies, you gotta understand something. There's a reason why Bam is quiet. You speaking on behalf of the predator, talking about, you know you wanted it. You know you was with it. You were 17. <laughs> you sound like the nigga that's trying to fuck the kids. <laughs> But these are the people that, was bugging. that they had to stand on the truth to protect the kids because they was hurt because they looked up to this nigga and he admitted in front of these same people in this video what he did to them. Oh, oh, he oh. admitted. And these people in this video, mm-hmm. Africa Bear Bada admitted to what he did to me. Uh-oh. He just started go we I got retitled this. Short video. Short video. This is Ahmed Henderson, the co-founder of the Universal Zulu Nation, and now the head of the Universal Zulu Nation. The official statement come from us, right here. Peace and love from the Universal Zulu Nation. We, the Supreme and World Council of the Universal Zulu Nation, based in New York City, who are in control of the Universal Zulu Nation. Nobody's moving in that God, picture. Are taking this time to adjust the membership and global yes, community in regards to Africa Bambada's role in our organization. We are publicly announcing the official removal of Africa Bambada from the Universal Zulu Nation. Based on the numerous allegations of child molestation, we as an organization cannot allow these accusations to tarnish the name and or... We stop it right there. What? He said numerous. The fuck just happened? I got retitled this video? Yo, Dan Dave Smith said that room smelled like a case. That's a fact. That's a fact, bro. Um, yo, nah, I met they had you on tape, bro. No, nah, nah, that wasn't I met. They didn't have I met on tape. They had um your other boy on tape. That's a fact. My apologies, I met. That wasn't you. They had somebody else on tape. I'm really slow. I got um retitled this video. But I'm glad, you know, I'm glad there was accountability and they stepped up and they 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 at least dropped that um that statement there as they should, as they should collectively as the Zulu Nation, because um it was just it's it's nasty work, man. The Zulu nasty. Nation really let down a lot of people. A lot of people yeah, was counting. They should have been got rid of that nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. A, a lot of people sh- man. They was counting on the Zulu Nation, bro. They really looked up to the Zulu Nation. The Zulu Nation could have been it. And to allow this man to live like that for so long and not say anything, it's just horrible, man. Where the hell Rowski go? Um oh I, I I took him down. I thought they I thought he was done. You know what I'm saying? Oh no, nah, no, nah. that nigga, that nigga snuck off of one of these old chicks, man. This nigga ain't slick. This nigga, <laughs> well, nigga this... Roski got low with the chicks early. That I'm up here talking no. to myself. Nigga got little. Okay, Roski. He he just wanted to come up here, do his one two, look around the room real quick, see what type of old chicks is in the crowd. You understand? He snatched one of them joints. One of them baddies out here live and all that. We less one person right now. I can tell you that right for a fact. We less one person. That nigga don't play. Roski don't play, man. Allegations. Numerous allegations. Numerous of child molestation. But right. Zip got on the internet and said, Hosh, you know you liked it. You know you liked it. Well... I mean, come on, Dad. Are we projecting again? Here we go projecting again. You said a lot of shit, nigga. That nigga ain't put his hand on no Bible and said none of the shit he said. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers capping back. Continue on. See, of the Universal Zulu Nation, we take these allegations very seriously. 
because we are a youth-driven organization with the mission of saving young lives through the advent of hip-hop culture all around the world. Until these allegations are addressed Damn, by Africa Bambada, we cannot allow Africa Bambada to be a part of our worldwide movement. As a point of clarification, Africa Bambada has Zulu Nation is worldwide. He said we can't allow him to be a part of our worldwide movement. Mind you, the nigga that's sitting up there denouncing Africa Bambada was molested by Africa Bambada himself. Been the leader of the UZN what? since 1994. Oh, this nigga dropped In 1994, bombs. UZN started a global realignment in order to better serve our global communities. It was during this realignment phase that Africa Bambada handed the reins of the UZN over to the Supreme and World Councils. Though we respect Africa Bambada for his humanitarian efforts, work within the UZN, and his overall contributions to hip hop culture, we can in no way allow these great things to cloud our judgments. The Zulu Nation has an obligation to its members and global communities to address any of these allegations of such a serious nature. Today's Universal Zulu Nation continues to operate under the principles of peace, unity, love, wisdom, understanding, freedom, justice, equality, overcoming the negative through the positive, and having fun to serve a higher purpose. These principles have always been the foundation of UZN, and through its ideology, we'll continue to serve our global communities selfishly. We ask all Zulu Nation members, please understand that no one person is bigger than the overall mission. We thank you and appreciate we ain't got to listen to the rest of that bullshit. You heard you enough? You definitely played too much of it in the first uh-huh. place. Yeah. You played too much of it in the first place. I, 